Noah's house in Pretoria, where our reporter Nobile is joining us. Uh, Nobile, sad news all around, deepest condolences to the family. Uh, but we understand that you had a conversation with the health minister, Dr. Aaron Mutualedi, earlier. What did he have to say concerning his interaction with the late Edna Malewa? Um, yes, we did speak to the health minister, and he was expressing his sadness. Um, after the shocking news that the, that the minister has passed on. So he did just explain, he was expressing his condolences and he was of course telling us about his history, um, how they know each other and how they had worked so well together and how it's such a loss to South Africa to have lost Edna Muliwa. Now, Mobile, you spoke of some of the interactions with the former minister. I mean, uh, he mentioned uh, uh, his relationship there. Can you just talk us through how did they meet and how did they form this camaraderie? And as you're standing outside her house, who are some of the people who have come in to pay their respects to the family? Um, well, so we have seen the family come in um, and they have asked that we obviously stay um, um, they have, oh, sorry, we have seen already the family coming in and they have already asked that um, they'd like to moan in private so we have seen the family coming in and um, the different members of ANC coming in also and they've just recently just briefed us now that um, the DSG will be speaking to us at around about half past six. Um, so that was um, what has happened so far and then also um, Mr. Mitsualedi was explaining that they had worked together as, and, and, and when, during the time when she was ill, um, he was then called in as a health minister and he was taking care of her and obviously looking into what was going on. Thank you so much for that update on that story. Uh, that was our reporter, Mobile, who is out.